so we're doing a vintage ride through Cape Town right now like we're in a classic car you said what what did you say the model is hello <laughs> this is a 1959 uh -huh. Jaguar Mark 9 1959 Jaguar Mark 9 so the plan today is to drive to a wine firm Constantia Greater wine firm Constantia Constantia wine firm so we're driving through the city on a bit of a tour and then to a wine firm I'm being told you can experience all five seasons in Cape Town in one day. <laughs> the weather changes so much, it was so nice and warm yesterday. And then today it's just cold. Out of nowhere. Or maybe I just didn't read the weather report. <laughs> yeah. Good Constantia wine. Good Constantia. David, do you drink wine? Sometimes. <laughs> wine is my drink of choice. Oh. And everyone says when you come to Cape Town, you must do a wine tour. So you haven't lived an issue that wine in Cape Town. Must taste the wine, so let's go see <laughs> what that's like. Check out this room. Nice view of Cape Town. Fortunately, cloudy. Oh, sorry. Look at this bathroom. Wow. Guys, of all things, can you imagine I forgot my bag at the place where we were doing the wine tasting? So, so I'm waiting at the Taj. This is the presidential suite. Our meeting has just ended. So I'm having champagne. Presidential suite, nice view. It's like not a bad place to wait it out, you know? But I hope it comes soon. Or that they even found it because I'm not certain exactly where I left it. Ugh. It has my passports and stuff, so fingers crossed. Good morning. Oh, no. It's super early morning today, so we're out kayaking. Uh, this is a two person kayak. I'm easy back there. And we're kayaking with Escape and Let's Go. <sighs> Very cold. My eyes are like blocks of ice. Mountain literally looks like a painting. And there's the stadium. Oh wow! Incredible. is so beautiful like I'll are you lucky. are you lucky. jaded already are you still <laughs> fascinated no, every eight, time you eight wake years up later and you still come mm. this place is stunning everybody has now gone from city and just the vibe <laughs> and it's a good life in front of you <laughs> as you can see it, uh, yeah, the sunrise oh brilliant
every night I've stayed here, they've had a surprise dessert for me. And today it's close to home. This is a bit like mahamri, mandazi, coated in coconut. I love this. Mm. The chef did his thing today. Mm. So I'm at Green Market Point. Came over with this guy. And they sell a lot of like African curio and my goodness, everything here is super beautiful. Mm. And it's different from like what we have in Maasai Market, Nairobi. So I feel like I'm just collecting things over here. Look at these. Like cute little rings. Look at these. These are all the ones I've set aside. I mean, I'm not gonna take all of them. But these look cute. Ugh. Winter, so it's not full time winter. Yeah, so we used to, can still get nice warm days. In yeah, we get warm days in between, so the weather changes a lot. Right now, I'm heading to Access Park. I hear there are a lot of stores in there, so I'm just going to do some shopping. One of the other places I've been to is what's it called? Waterfront Calc Bay. Is Calc Bay very far from Access Park? I was invited to go to uh. some store there, but it's too far. So not sure I'm gonna make it and then that's the plan for today then going to have cocktails at this spot called Mount Nelson and then might pop into this other spot called the silo so that's the plan for today before I need to head back home so let's go see what Cape Town's shopping scene has to offer I feel like this trip for me was all just about shopping <laughs> yeah Thank you. 